obviously you are in your uniform mind you but when you approach a person hey ata dani unataka kumuipia so you'll be like where is the bag for example this is the bag and they were carry they were just moving when you just approach them you'll be like like bro i don't want to steal from you i just want to request if i can do your hair hey Jaman. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Tikal Kaka and today we are talking about mental health, hair stuff, beauty school stuff. And before we go on with the video, please hit that subscribe button. How are you? I forgot to ask how are you mentally, physically, financially, spiritually. Hope you're doing good as we wrap up the year. Hope you achieved all that you had planned and if not don't beat yourself give yourself grace next year is there and you still can achieve what you desire yeah and again do you know that make grooming boost your confidence did you know that because every other time when we either do our hair our nails we tend to you feel you're in the a cloud nine yeah yes you have to know that grooming relates to mental health it makes you feel like got too sour yeah and there is connection between beauty and mental well-being uh, for me when I do my hair my mood is just like up air I just feel confident i feel good and yeah that feeling i love it i know each and every one of you may maybe love that as well yeah and they sense about that it influences how we feel about ourselves and i recently concluded my beauty school and i just wanted to give the difference between beauty school and campus life i think i love the beauty school more because one hands-on experience like in campus they wait until you go to attachment but with beauty school like if we're learning today the stitch line or the two strand or the three strand just a bit of theory and take your dummies go transfer from the paper and now to the real thing yeah and that is what excites me most because i know i'll know there and then that i've known this thing different between beauty school and campus life as i said the beauty school you will have the hands-on experience right there and then because you studied the theory you go take your dummy or yeah you practice it on dummy first and then with time you bring the real person to come in practice with with them another thing industry exposure they usually like make um, workshops bring people who have been in the industry for long gives you they educate you on one two three about uh, the beauty business yeah and they even tell you how to invest all that and what is required of you you know they they even uh, incorporate the the financial institutions whereby you can get loans to start up your business but not until when you're done and graduated is where we can do that for you and i just basically love the beauty school there is no much pressure i'm lying i'm lying <laughs> yeah uh, and the problem comes when you're finding clients for practicals yo you can just go down um uh, outside the the school and then obviously you're in your uniform mind you but when you approach a person hey so you'll be like where is the bag for example this is the bag and they were carry they were just moving when you just approach them you'll be like like bro i don't want to steal from you i just want to request if i can do your hair hey jaman there was a time nilikuwa nimekosa mtu wa barbary so i went 
down Afia Center hapo so not a lot there is a lot of traffic people are just moving up and down so I, so I approached someone and I'm like can I do can I shave your hair like it was just a request but they give you bombastic side eye and you're like yo I was just requesting no I must I know but maybe you're my kiss mat and that is it if you don't want okay next so and then the, this time that a classmate approached someone I don't know the service that she was doing and then she was like no I'm past training I don't do only experts do that do my hair yes I don't refuse but you just tell them in a nice way you know like instead of showing attitude anyways struggles <laughs> Okay, I, this video, I've uh, really made it for the longest, like, my phone notifying me that it's full, me trying to clear the space, and even my story is not flowing, but I just wanted to say that um, your mental health and grooming go hand in hand, so make sure every other time your confidence is top notch by grooming yourself making your hair nails dressing well yeah and i don't know today i'm just flexing flexing but because i feel um i look good i tried the what do we call this it was my first time but yo i think it came out so good and maybe i can wrap up this video by saying that if you're planning to go to beauty school just that dream go go and you put your mind to something you can do it so if you want to enroll in beauty school go girl go guy <laughs> ah, what, what, what. <laughs> yeah just that dream do that course that technical course it can be a three-month course but it will give you give you skills that will make you a millionaire perhaps yeah <laughs> okay so uh see in the next video make sure you hit the subscribe button share comment and tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel